Hey love bugs, it's Rosalind back at you one more again. I hope everybody is doing blessed. I'm doing blessed and highly favored and definitely hope the same for you. And if this is your first time stopping by my channel, much love to you and welcome. And to my returning subs, my grown extended beautiful family as always. Thank you so much for the love and support. It's truly, totally appreciated. And it's truly, truly appreciated. So with that being said, much love to all. Namaste, love and blessings, love and light. And many blessings are definitely coming your way. And if you've been watching my videos for a while and have not, please drop a line. I would love a chance to get to know you as much as you're getting to know me and I hope that the video that I am um, dropping right now you know can truly be you know informative to you it can give you something you can truly re resonate with um, so I hope you're able to you know resonate with it and the video I'm doing right now is called Twin Flame 101 Hey Oka is just because you're a warrior not all wars is meant for your battle and it's true you know um, there there are times where I've caught myself saying it as well I've heard others you know all um, I'm in this uh, karmic cycle or I'm in this connection with this person that person because I'm supposed to heal them or I'm needing a protector or you know I'm, I'm, I'm needing that knight in shining armor number one we are our, our superheroes if we're looking for somebody we gotta look in the mirror you know there's times that we we instead of climbing the mountain we choose to carry it you know and a lot of times when it gets hard to bear we don't realize we're not just carrying our own uh, weight of a mountain we're carrying other people's you have to be able to drop those loads not every you know not everything that is coming your way you pose to heal it and that's a lot of times where the empaths gets that it, we get that totally misconstrued like everything that comes your way doesn't need your healing you know a lot of times when you're always wondering why am I so drained every time I hang out with this this and that person maybe because it's not nourishing you maybe this is not that vibration that, that person may carry is not for you you know but now it's gonna get to that point where if it start happening too much it you you should be able to learn that to where okay is this is this important what I got my cause that I'm trying to create no okay let me drop it you know just certain things something you know it has to come in it is you have to have that vibration it is what it is it was fun while it lasted let me keep on you know there's a lot of times we connect with things just to be able to tell it because there's a lot of times we connect with people and really push you know uh vibes where you know they're mirroring everything that we went through and then sometimes it can still be in in our in our circle and sometimes we can be in that connection where we still keep in touch and there's sometimes they just you know drop off face of the earth and they doing their thing and doing our thing you know and it is okay but there's you know usually when that's happening it's something that's showing you you know what needs to be healed is there a trigger that's coming up you know um then there's something that you have to focus on within yourself if it's somebody who's placing the trigger of projection on you that has you have to be able to allow yourself to not take that personal and a lot of times we take it personal i've been there i'm like you know i was being so nurturing with such and such and such and i was being so encouraging to this person and all of a sudden they flip the script on that and then it's just like you have to understand there's a lot of people that are still highly connected to their ego there's a lot of things that we're still learning about ourselves and that is okay because when we can see where our issues are that's lining it up with that okay am I am I being encouraging am I allowing myself to let fear you know you know overtake everything that I got going on um am I allowing myself even when I'm being nice to somebody and somebody's just not being nice to me am I allowing that to really just ruin my day or just try to understand you know you got to remind yourself everybody's facing the battle everybody's facing a battle just because you're on that vibration of healing understanding you know going towards that deeper level you can't make people do that you can't make people heal you can't force people to want to be happy you can send love all you all you want even to people you're in your karmic cycles with even if you're connected to narcissistic people you have to be able to be that vibration to say you know what I can't take it personal everybody has the war that just because I'm a warrior doesn't mean this is not not every battle it, it, not everything I need to be battling. I'm battling my own situation. I'm battling my own healing. I'm battling my old self. I'm battling that enemy in the inside so the enemy on the outside cannot even disturb me. You recognize different things of where you need to allow yourself. Don't embody everything that's coming towards you. That's not meant for you to do. And when you're learning that, you're, you're starting to get that. Because a lot of times we get mad 
when we open ourselves up it's just showing you certain things you need to stop sharing with people certain um certain things when you have gone through not everybody needs to know that because sometimes sooner or later it can be used against you you know never tell people what you're what you're about to do because a lot of times self-destructive energy is on the ear listening so they can see where they can destruct that at or make sure that doesn't never come to come to play for you you know not you know announce anything until it's in concrete for you if you choose to share that stay humble every single time you know stay humble all the time just because you up in the air don't mean the universe and God will not knock you down to reality when you're not appreciating you know how far you have come being able to understand you know you're not the same person that you used to be you're that warrior you're recognizing that warrior within yourself warriors don't go through weak minded situations They're, you're not going to have petty situations you're going to go through some real hard stuff because this is how we're learning about ourselves we're learning about people learning what people not to deal with you know we have to deal with certain things so it can give you those red flags and not collect red flags you don't need that one to walk away you feel that flipping that daggone vibration that person carry you know not everybody needs that announcement I'm in, in that vibration where I'm handling myself accordingly if I see where I'm I'm not a priority to you you're not appreciating I'm appreciate my, appreciate myself to step back that's not my battle you're facing then you know that is not my battle you're facing. But I'm sending healing vibes wherever you're needing it. I hope you're finding your utopia of inner um, inner um, happiness and not external balances of happiness. Whatever you're going through, I'm sending the best of luck to you while I keep moving. You know, it's just like everybody's not a part of your journey. But, you know, hey, if it's worth it, you know, if we meet again, we're going to meet again. If not, I still wish you the best. So you're going through these journeys. You're a warrior. It shows you what a warrior does. You know, we're helping other people. When it's time for us to regroup, we're going to regroup. When God is telling us in the universe, hey, saddle up, battle up, you know, that's our time. But a lot of times it's just like, hey, get that white flag up. This ain't that, that that's not for you. Come on. <laughs> you know, like that's not for you. Come on. So I hope you were able to resonate with the content of the video, y'all. Like I said, you know, universe got me going in, in some uh, huge changes. So I feel weird. I'm like, dang, am I not supposed to say something else? Everything ain't got to be elongated. Sometimes it could be a 20, 45 minute video. And sometimes it could be a 5, 10 minute video. It don't always have to be like that. Because not, you know, especially if you like me, you got OCD and ADD. Sometimes it's hard for you to keep your attention like that. If it's short and sweet, you know, hey. It can do that. If you really need that extent talk too, hey, that's there too. So I hope you are able to resonate with the content of this video, y'all. I would love to give a post notification to Annie I. Much love to you as well. Uh, Wildflower, much love to you. Sam C., much love to you. And, you know, um, Alex, you already know. And uh, Andre Alvarez, much love to you as well. You know, if you're new to my channel, much love to you. It's so good to have you. Please drop a line. I would love a chance to get to know you as much as you're getting to know me. I always... Keep my, my um, contact information in the description box below. It's all about spiritual networking. Oh, I'm letting people know because I've been having people like, Hey, Roslyn, I got something going on. Can you DM me? If you need help, contact me. I don't do that. I, you know, I'm, I'm, you know, we can be dyslexic, but if you need that help, you need to reach out to me. That's, that's the only way it's going to happen. Whatever we speak on is confidential. You know, I try my best to be able to help you. If you're, even if you're, you know, you're telling me something that you went on and maybe you just need some, ease, you know, insight to see uh, a deeper understanding. Hey, I'm, I'm here. I'm here. I'm your girl. You know, I try my best to be able to understand. I'm like, oh, yeah, I can help with this. You know, even if it's something new. Hey, if universe has opened that door for me for a new adventure, for a new challenge, I'm up for it. So, you know. Hey, whatever's clever. Whatever we discuss is discuss. I said discuss. Discuss is confidential. So I try my best to be able to help out the best way I can. And if you feel generous enough, please drop a donation. The Cast app is there too as well. So you'll see me on my next video. Whatever you are manifesting into your life, trust and believe it. If you have not got it yet, some you know universe is unfolding for something that you never imagined, and it could be more than what you expected, and it can sooner be sooner than you predicted. So keep going. You know, be persistent and consistent. Be willing to broaden your, you know, your perspective on your creativity of purpose. And even through social distancing, make sure you give out love, light, positivity, words, vibes, frequencies. You never know. All those things really take somebody a long way. And just because you took your time out to do that, it's going to take you even further. Much love to you. 